evacuation orders just issued for U.S. families after Trump learns what 10K is about to do with eyes here. The threat that World War III was coming increased from talk to becoming a reality in our very near future after a shocking turn of events over the weekend that North Korea's despot dictator Kim Jong-un can't and won't recover from. Now, with the start of the new week, we're officially on the dawn of what we've been warned that's coming and is officially here. As U.S. families are being forced to evacuate, Kim Jong wanted a war and wasn't going to stop until he got one and now he must accept the fact that he doesn't stand a chance against the greatest military in the world. National Security Advisor Herbert McMaster has maintained that this threat reached a critical level after increasing day by day until it got to this point. The Daily Star reported, just last week the Kim regime fired an intercontinental ballistic missile that flew over 1,000 feet higher than their previous launch that took place in July. These missile launches have been occurring for months now without any permission from the international community, proving to be provocations of a war they were asking for. Yesterday, we reported what McMaster had to say about World War III and now we're seeing just how serious he was in his statement. We're in a race to be able to solve this problem. There are ways to address this problem short of armed conflict, but it is a race because he's getting closer and closer and there's not much time left. The greatest immediate threat to the U.S. and to the world is the threat posed by the rogue regime in the North and its efforts to develop a long-range nuclear capability. So. It's immensely important that we work together with all of our allies, partners, everyone internationally, to convince Kim that the continued pursuit of these capabilities is a dead end for him and his regime. Hours after making this statement, evacuation orders were given to American families on military bases in South Korea, saying that they should leave because war between America and Pyongyang is getting close, a senior U.S. senator and ex-Air Force colonel said. Republican Senator Lindsey Graham has warned that the rising tensions between the U.S. and Kim Jong-un's corrupt regime means preparations for war need to be taken. The member of the Senate Armed Services Committee warned the U.S. was running out of time to prepare itself for war when speaking on CBS yesterday. He said, I want the Pentagon to stop sending dependents and I think it's now time to start moving American dependents out of South Korea. We're getting close to a military conflict because North Korea is marching toward marrying up the technology of an ICBM with a nuclear weapon on top that can not only get to America, but deliver the weapon.